gonna get ready and go do a little squirrel hunt with Champ and Remy here. And uh, gonna do a little walk around here. See how many squirrels we can get today. And how many trees we can do. And we're here in uh, Creech Creek and Pilton County here. We'll see how good, good we do today. We'll be back with you and see, show you, show you some hunts and pictures of squirrels. Dog's treat up here. We're going up here and see what they got. Well, Champ's treat anyway. Looks like he's on a cedar tree. So. Might be kind of hard to find him. That's uh, a big old, big old dead snag right beside of it. So. I'm sure it's in a hole. Yeah, I see that squirrel's in a hole. I don't figure he even smells it. Champ's got a lot colder nose than he does. Hunting squirrels here, guys. Never had three them before. Old dog put one. There's one of them. Learned how they went back in. Right there. One's at the tip top. Oh, there's the other one right there looking at us. We're gonna let these guys go. That's pretty cool. We ain't gonna shoot no flying squirrels. Pretty little fellers, though. <laughs> That's why Remy wasn't treeing much. Man, it would be nice if I did this fall. Good boy, Champ. Treat you some fly, your first flying squirrel here in West Virginia. I got a Good boy. Good boy, Remy. I don't know he. He ain't barking on these flying squirrels much. Good boy, champ. <laughs> hey, your first flying squirrel you ever seen? No, I've seen one that landed in our swimming pool at the house. But, There's one. but it got away. Up there's the other one. You can kind of see camera focus here on him. You can kind of see his flaps there sticking out just a little bit. You need to stay. I know I'm shaking a little bit, but it's a pretty squirrel though. This little old devil's here in West Virginia. I ain't gonna say ain't no big ones. I ain't never seen no big ones. I've always seen the little ones. Get him, champ. Good boy. Good boy, champ. Right, we got another gray squirrel treat here. Remy and Champ doing their job. I don't know if I can get them on video. I'm gonna try. They're down in a sinkhole. You can bear, just bear with them. Dogs are down there. I don't know if you can see them. They're way down in the bottom of a sinkhole. Right there. I'm gonna try to get this squirrel shot here. Another gray squirrel. Hey, Scotty, whenever you're ready. Let me get him back in video here. Moving around the trail, Scotty. Scotty can't get shot at him. Scotty, two of them. He 
Remy's right there on your side. Now get down there and let Remy loose. Or go find that other zip. I'm going to try to get up. Scotty can't shoot today. Here, 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 A Remy and Champ treat on the squirrel. Talk to him. Talk to him. Scotty. I'm going to get back on the squirrel. down and get him move around you get see if you can get shot <laughs> Stop. 
You're shooting? Yeah, I can't get shot at him. I'm shooting the nass right now. There, I might be able to get shot at him. Go ahead. Johnny's there playing with it. Try to get rid of me there, little pup. Yeah. Okay. Now I'll fix the skinny squirrel. This is my little setup I got built into my dog box here. Slides in and out. Your dog box. I, I built when I built this box. I just built it right into the box. This thing works great for when you skinning squirrels and stuff. Small game, you stick your legs right in there like that. Push down a little bit, and there you go. You're ready to skin your squirrel as soon as you find your knife. Done lost my knife. There it is. And a good thing to have when you skin a squirrel is a good sharp knife. You just start right there at your, your butthole. Get that down through there. It's a pretty good sized old male fox squirrel here. They're a little tougher skin sometimes. Once you get broke through that bone, I mean, it's for guys, you know, y'all ain't never scunned those squirrels before wanting to learn or whatever. This little skinner here thing, it, boy, it, it makes it nice. Just work that back through there like that, getting that meat killed around there. I'll have Scotty go up there in my truck, in the door, and get my pliers, my cutters for me. I usually like to try to peel this on around a good way so I don't know if we don't tear nothing. And you just take that there and just slowly work that down like that. You get it peeled down. No fox will some of these are pretty tough. Get it filled down. I just like to take through there and cut that off. And just keep working that down. And get down to receive shoulders. Pop them through. Pop them through. Take the cutters. Pop that off. 
pop that off. I'll just go ahead and cut the hide off right here. Lay it off. And you just take the squirrel, flip it over, put the head in the bigger part of the V here. That's a big fox squirrel. His head ain't wanting to go down in there too good. It might be good enough. And I got my old trusty vice grips here, and I just hook them there. Of course, my dog's coming over, trying to get the squirrel. Get down, Patch. I'm pulling it. Get my pliers tight enough here. Pull that down. Same to the other side. I can do this a little faster. I'm just kind of doing a little slur for you guys. Of course, you just get your cutters. Go through, give the dog something to eat. Chew on. If you got a big male, of course, you got to cut his you know, stuff out. Get it out of there. You just look through here. Work your way down through. Just like so. Get the gut and the heart. Get all that out of there. Give it a pitch, come back up, get your leg stuck in there a little bit, and you just cut the head off, give it a pitch, and there you got your fresh clean squirrel, just as easy as that, of course you got to wash it off a little bit, that's all there is to it. Thanks for watching South Branch Valley Outdoors. If you would, hit that subscribe button. Give us a like. If you got any questions about this skin or how I've made it or anything, let us know. And we'll get back with you and give you instructions on how I made it and everything. Because you don't have to have it to where it's built in your box. You can just make one put on the side of a tree or anything. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time.